police in the Inland Empire and Orange County are searching for a convenience store gunman responsible for a deadly crime spree. But it's unclear if that is the same gunman wanted here in Los Angeles. Two people have been shot and killed several others injured in that robbery spree. KTLA Shelby Nelson live with what we are learning about the victim. Shelby. Yeah, sure, Micah. This is one of the locations that was robbed yesterday here in Riverside on La Sierra Avenue. And I just got off the phone with Upland Police. Uh, we have confirmed that all six of the robberies that happened yesterday, police believe they are from the same suspect. Now, we did speak with the family of one of the victims who was shot at that La Habra location. They say he was just sitting inside of his car when that suspect shot through his passenger side window. I thought in that moment that I lost my dad. He said, honey, and I knew something was wrong because it, it was like he had a ton of stuff in his mouth. A phone call early Monday morning, Georgianne Browning never could have imagined her husband Russell reaching her from a La Habra 7-Eleven parking lot. And I said, Russ, what's wrong? And he said, honey, I've, I've been shot. And I said, what do you mean you've been shot? And he said to me, don't worry if I die, I know where I'm going. Georgian says a La Habra police officer then got the phone to tell her her husband had been shot in the face and was being taken to the hospital. Police saying a else. suspect had shot through Russell's passenger window as he sat inside his car in the parking lot of a 7-Eleven on East Whittier Boulevard. I just said, please tell him I love him and we'll be there. In some, some cases, wish I could take his place. You know, I he's he's been through he's been through enough in his life, and uh, he he doesn't deserve to go through that. Georgian and Brandon, their son, now searching for answers after they say Russell had just stopped to get donuts and milk. His car still with shattered glass inside from the day before. Russell was one of several victims in a string of violent robberies at 7-Eleven stores across the Southland. There were a total of six different robberies starting in Ontario around midnight before moving through Upland, Riverside, Santa Ana, Brea and La Habra. Two people were killed, including a clerk at a Brea 7-Eleven, three others injured. Authorities now connecting this man to at least five of the robberies in that violent morning rampage. We're finally able to confirm that uh, our suspect in our robbery and shooting from yesterday morning here in Riverside uh, does appear to be the same one involved uh, in these others, um, wearing you know, the same clothing, same description. Now, Russell's family does tell me that his mouth will have to be wired shut in order for him to recover. That's what doctors are telling them.